Hey everybody, welcome back to Overtly Mocking Games. This is Michael T. Bradley. And OMG, it's J. Wilfred Neville! And we are here for the final section of Gabriel Knight's Sins of the Fathers. We are so excited. It looks like... Oh, shit, totally blanking on the name. Uh, Grace might be kidnapped. Molly has got evil Tadalo insider. We have a shot in Jaeger talisman and our uncle's dead and so is our best friend, but we keep using his credit card because we're jackasses. <laughs> yeah, I think that Grace got kidnapped by a wind? Yes, the, the evil wind. The wind, yeah. It traveled between the ways. Rand was nearly destroyed by it in book one. Anyway, um... <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's jump right into this exciting ending. What do you say? Let's do it. Hong Kong. <laughs> I'm gonna miss those traffic noises. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna miss that dog on the map that we never visit. I know. I'm. I'm. I. I wish we'd go back to see Grandma for a little bit. Right. I'm, I'm gonna miss that cat carrier by the door. Let's oh, go read the German no. English dictionary for Christ. a few minutes before. Let's check our words. <laughs> <laughs> we, oh, are we are going to check our horoscope <laughs> just for old times' sake. Time, <laughs> Dated June 28, 1993. <laughs> the weather service is oh, marked by reader. the series of bizarre storms bizarre. that rocked the south <laughs> yesterday. Twenty died and close to a hundred. Uh, is that related to us at all? I mean, yeah, I know. Know. So, right. did we kill those people? Twenty what died? People? I guess so. For the past three years has to unprecedented levels. Okay. And there have been. I guess I don't think of Nolans as part of the South. You know. In really? Alone. It's like deep south like swamp south i know but it just seems like its own little universe it's its own country gabriel reads his horoscope for the day today will be fine arm thyself with righteousness the final hour awaits and avoid the tuna somewhere who's damn confused wait so just pointing out that really that horoscope is written for us and us alone. The note yeah. is from Malia. It's a... Hey, hope to see you tonight. I hope you survive long enough to get this. Tetelo knows you have the talisman. Your life is worth nothing, my love. I fight to save you, but she controls Today is Valentine's far. Day when we're recording, <laughs> and so I, I, I think that's a good Valentine's to say. Your life yeah. is worth Wall nothing, my love. Written in glitter, especially. <laughs> I can't help you. <laughs> I gotta go get out my paper crafting I can't stuff. You die. Please believe me. I love you, Malia. Oh, well, that's nice. She didn't have to send a note. Who's there? Hey, our painting is back. It's me, Wolfgang. Yeah, good for you. Did they? I got a headache. Did they forget? You don't. Come that the painting. Near. You're dead. Oh, I guess so. Yeah. Oh. Or did it come back? Yeah, you at the tube? You should have said something. You mean you weren't dead, you son of a bitch? Do I look dead? No, no, don't answer that. Wait, what? Well, I okay. was searching the tomb. When I heard someone coming, I broke the light and got in the drawer. Sorry I brained you, but I thought you were one of them. <laughs> Christ, you about killed me. I said I was sorry. Anyway, have you I seen my wallet? I in my badge. It makes you feel any better. <laughs> I lost my wallet now. And my Your credit wife. card company has been calling me about some really right. suspicious <laughs> charges. Like I said. Anyway, we shouldn't stand out here and dab. Someone on the street might see us. Let's go and back. Does the fact that Mosley's not dead make it better or worse? Uh, I don't know, but um, but yeah, I guess it's like maybe okay. maybe that painting now being back talk. was a big was like a hint that Mosley was coming back. All right. Let's talk. Tell who me about we, we snakes. We sold the painting to like somebody who owns a shop nearby or something. What right, right the Bryce? egregiously gay uh, haircut guy. Goddamn bastard. We have to find her and save her. Goddamn bastard. Out the police department for any help. So, fill me in on what you've been doing for the Were there five two days. fill me ins? I've been getting smart, that's what. <laughs> I've been taking they these smart running, pills. I'll admit. Or Today, what are they called? Smart drugs? I've been taking these smart jumbo drugs. Chan magicians can catch your light foot moles. Can't take them orally, though, so I'm gonna and need I'll you to help me much. with my next dose. Now, these guys have it wired, I tell you. 
from the mayor to a couple of major judges, right down to the beat cops. The Gettys are untouchable. The beat cops like angle. Allen Ginsberg. Once I really mm -hmm. start digging, it mm. was like I could see clearly. These guys are into everything that happens in this city, and most people are scared shitless of them. Or they don't know about them at all. Some of them are both, which is extra confusing. Let me we have insult him as an option. <laughs> I know. Okay, have at it. Let me fill well, you in. Okay, Maya have at Eddie it. Is the head mm -hmm. of the cartel. Dr. John is our right-hand man. Also, he's war. I learned that much. We sure know how to pick him, right? Uh-huh. She's not really responsible, though, because during these ceremonies, she's ridden by the spirit of her ancestor, Tetelo. If you know what I you mean. You don't say. Well, that it's makes true. sense. Anyway, <laughs> I have some <laughs> talisman that I can use against them. It'll help. But they probably still have a power source somewhere in their home fool. I don't know if it's just bad audio quality or what, but there are some times when history. people are talking where there's this evil thing. devil about echo behind them. Ago. Look, don't confuse hmm, I don't get me, that. Okay? You worry about all that metaphysical stuff, and I'll, I'll just, just try, try to get catch the bad, the bad guys. guys. Yeah, you'd never believe me anyway. Insult him. Let's make a plan. What do you think we should do? Well, I think we can catch we the key, we can catch the teacher off the guard. <laughs> Rescue Grace and dig up some concrete evidence so that I can take this straight to the FBI. Sounds easy. Uh huh. Do you have any idea where their headquarters might be? The FBI? Uh, Maybe the federal building. You seem to have an act for sniffing out this voodoo stuff. Why don't you see if you can locate it for sure? I found some voodoo Meanwhile, right here under the bed. Do. I'll meet you there later. <laughs> Oh, How are you nope, fine? that's dried semen. Damn, that's right. <laughs> Only I had the tracker from my office. Actually, I, really? in my pants here. Good going. You give it to me and leave a signal device at the entrance to the headquarters. All right. And then I'll swoop in at the last minute in a very uh, uh, dramatic way. You know, mostly, don't even start with me, Knight. I've been through too much for you lately. Yeah, you're right. Sorry. And sold him again. Do it again. Him. He is the tracker. Great. Uh, don't forget to leave the signal device near the entrance to the home core. And be careful. Okay. Now let's sit down and write a letter to Grandma on the typewriter. <laughs> you too. Bedtime? Yeah. Didn't we just get up? Oh no, we just got home. Right. We're so probably we don't really, jet lagged it like could be hell. Any time of the day. Yeah. I still want to know when he's going to hang out and write some couplets about all this. <laughs> We're going to go Time find to another church. dead junkie. Yeah. We're going to go Dead confess. junkies are a dime a dozen at the church. Especially in the Norlinian churches. We should steal one of these angels. We never know when it might come in handy. We've got the pocket space. <laughs> the confessional is about the size of a closet and is richly paneled in lovingly oiled chair. Not really sure why There's like a knot cherry hole was... about the size of a quarter in the wood panel. Oh, are we gonna go spy on a priest now? That's weird, Gabriel. Another glory hole. For someone really tall. Something about this knot hole looks familiar. <laughs> How did we get that thing back on an airplane? Ooh. It's moving. We got every. No. This was 1993. We got everything back on an airplane. Rides over. So, how long do you think an actual player would have wandered around the city? Gabriel puts the snake rod under the bench for Moses. Oh, wow. Before realizing that there was a knot hole in the confession booth. All right, Moses. And sticking the snake signal. thingy in it. I... wow. The elevator stops at a room underneath the cathedral. There's an exclamation point there. Express no, I know. Elevator to hell. She just, she just the elevator she just returns to the cathedral. Just Gabriel, stop now. 
Well, it was a little more like emphatic. Yeah, we got that breathy. That piece of art on the wall looks like something the Gettys had transplanted from Africa. <laughs> or it looks like somebody running to an outhouse and it should have under it, when you gotta go, you gotta go. <laughs> The Enterprise now? <laughs> I want to believe that all churches are like this underneath. <laughs> yeah, just think, somebody looking for that probably, like, oh my god, you went and talked to Grandma for like 20 minutes hoping she had a clue, you know? Right. That, that Although I think that when it said he doesn't know where to go, to go, or does he, I think he was looking out the window at Jackson Square and the cathedral. Hmm. I think I'll take this wolf mask for me. Uh, all right, whatever. For, I mean, for, we have the sexy, crocodile for sexy times. Nice. This boa mask seems appropriate for Mosley, if he ever makes it. Now, why did we leave some things for Mosley, yet we're taking that for Mosley? Ceremonial robes hang behind the other supplies. Yeah, this plan of getting disguised and going into the middle of the ceremony worked really well last Large time. Large storage <laughs> barrels are Hopefully Grace will come and roll. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> we got another wheel within a wheel thing here I guess it's cool if I just go to catholic churches and start shoving sticks into their confessional booths yelling <laughs> where's the enterprise right <laughs> There's a little Bebe map on the wall. You are here. Oh, now we're gonna do some IT work before this we. Is like, this must be this one of the occult business office building. Of the Getty cartel. <laughs> a portrait of a beautiful. Oh yeah, this is part of the new seeds program they have in place here. She reminds Gabriel of Malia. A mother, perhaps? Or maybe it's Malia? I mean, the white it could, you know, contains what looks like calculus equation. To Gabriel, because he's an no, idiot, but it's actually it just is. geometry. Although or Gabriel something. is no computer expert, those look like high-priced models to him. <laughs> no expense has been you spared can tell in the they're white. headquarters. Yeah. Remember when computers were white? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Gabriel looks no. at the inbox and sees a black record book. Okay. Pick it up. Dear Diary. Oh, it's Nana Narrator's Diary. This record <laughs> book might be the kind of thing Mosley wanted for the FBI. Of course, he could probably just get that himself if he. <laughs> I mean, I. Mean. Why don't you write down the equations, Gabriel? Those might be important. Meh. It's that new math. That's voodoo math. <laughs> there are lots of electrical outlets out here in the wheel within a wheel, so that's good. Because you need to plug in a floor buffer sometimes and stuff. Right, vacuums. Whoa, this is this is not part of the office building. <laughs> I was this is uh, the, the, the HR department. I was looking for the uh, oh, it's Mosley's credit card. <laughs> Let run away. I, I was just looking for the snack machine. Just grab the sword, cut him in the head. No. Okay. Well, that was that was weird. We obviously need that ID badge. Don't need it that badly. Oh, that wall's gonna open. Watch out, Gabriel. Oh, shit, 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 shit. <laughs> or, okay. That's and climb in the Jeffrey's tubes. That's where the carry-on luggage is stored. <laughs> oh, hell, I gotta could have put These a couple more iron rods in story. here. Tetalo holding up the talisman. A ship sailing. Now we're gonna learn to play the bongos. Slaves rising up and killing their own as Haiti. What? what? Looks like Tetalo's people are arriving in New Orleans. Haiti, probably, even though we know that this started in Benin or whatever. Great power through voodoo. What was that picture? Accumulating the great power through voodoo. Is built under Jackson Square. Heck of a family album. 
And there's the transporter pod the over there. The Harmful Portal Meter. Uh, what? Not a narrator just slipped into a different language there. Okay, I'll give it a shot, but I'm no musician. Oh, we are going to learn to play the bongos. No, no, the rattos. A door opens in the distance. First right. try. Now, so we're just going to, like, keep taunting Brother Eagle? Is that what we're doing here? Oh, uh, we're calling him so we can go get the ID card. Is that who was in there? I guess so. Else, why would we have put Brother Eagle? How do we how do we know that? Because <laughs> he's praying in an eagle altar, obviously. Oh. As evinced by the uh, the cow skull. Right, and the human skull and the elephant tusks. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Kicking it in overdrive. Some funky Actually, the color life. scheme here is kind of like one of those Covenant battleships in uh, Halo. If you say so. They have a similar color scheme, purple and silver. It fits. I only read the Halo fiction. <laughs> Bye. I have an Xbox. And parts and bodies are kept on Eric the Nyland is quite an author. Beds. Oh yeah. The Look, there's little like leather face masks on the wall. That's, that's sweet. Yeah, he's got a batleth here in the foreground. I think I'm gonna be <laughs> sick. Fools of the trade, it seems. Wow, she seems These really spry for that line. To be stopped. What, morticians? The surgical <laughs> lamps is a gurney with a body on it. Sorry, medical examiners. Human hearts. I think that might actually be so a painting of Mitt Romney up them. there on the left. But why? <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't even ask. They're used for some powerful gree gree, no doubt. <laughs> Or maybe that's what Tetelo has for lunch. Ugh, I hope those are rubber masks. I like how he over enunciates like foreign words and be like, I gotta up <laughs> be like me saying, I gotta update my resume. Resume. Performed in this room. A stainless steel bucket is I like that the they floor. just kill people and save the hearts, so like in case they need to get downstairs, downstairs, they just, you know, they got a heart to grab <laughs> and throw in there. Like, oh shit, I forgot the pepper down there. Throw in a heart. <laughs> is the heart consumed, do you think, in the process I, of unlocking the cellar? I guess so. We should have, like, <laughs> brought a... Uh, Wolfgang's heart, so that in case we needed to get into an emergency voodoo room. <laughs> wow, I'm glad that Parazing has been able to t keep these doors separate. Now we're getting another one we didn't earlier? A robe for prosperity. Pro wait, was that posterity or prosperity? Uh, the, the line actually said prosterity. I know, and he said prosperity, which doesn't really seem to make much sense, does it? No. But posterity doesn't... I what the... whatever. <laughs> okay, so open up that storage compartment. Okay, that was, that was the wrong hallway, obviously. Obviously. We don't want to haul it. No, is that not the... okay, I guess... where the hell are we going? I think we just did a full lap. The stuff in this room is bad really guys blurry. make all the money. This this does seem like an awful lot of money. I assume this is what the back of like pawn shops around money. here look like it's now. Good cause. <laughs> well, we can just. I hate to say it, but I can't carry any more. Should have oh, got a well, gold bar. A million or so yeah. to hold me. 
They only probably weigh like 120 pounds or something. I can't imagine how that money is going to come in useful during the rest of this game. We got a little DD lead thing for it though. Like you do. Like you do. I think at this point Perzink's just going around and around and around. <laughs> okay, we gotta go fill up on sensors. I guess this is the sensor holding room. Okay. <laughs> Grace! I found them! The sound of Radha drums echo to the Hanvur. The ritual must be about to begin. Is he gonna sing Amazing Grace to her now? <laughs> Was, was that Mr. Fantastic? Oh, okay. Thank God. I thought I saw you ducking in here. Apparently, Gabriel is not very sneaky. Those goddamn drums started as soon as I got off that elevator thing, and I heard voices from above. I have a feeling the mass voodooies are about to invade. What? I found Grace. <laughs> is he? I see that. Like Check leaning on that then table, or is he like doing bud. squats? I think he's sitting on a sink. <laughs> he's like sitting on Grace's face. Gabriel there. has in his <laughs> possession the Ritter family talisman. He'll never forget that it was regained only through. through uh, what's his blood. name? Uh, hmm. Doing that thing, you know. Yeah. This talisman is supposed to have some sort of power. So if I just rub it on her titties here. Right. Wake up. Right. <laughs> Smack her with the talisman. What? What's going on? Gabriel, I was asleep, Gabriel, not Mostly. Where are we? What's going on? We're in the Getty Cartel. Were you Fuga in place, like a million years of, I mean, except through like just trial and error, afraid, thought that the talisman will wake Grace up? Like, why are? would we think that? I, heard them in I don't sleep, know, maybe they up. did everything first, like yeah. wave the money but under her nose. Right. Stab curious. her with that knife. <laughs> what are we going to do now? <laughs> All right, let's make a plan. Which we apparently we also brought do, back, back on the airplane. You're asking oh, yeah. me? Oh, God. 1993, man. Well, I realize I'm the professional, but you do know more about what we're up against here. It's 1993 and he's okay, white. Okay. I mean, you know. They expect That's you true. to be unconscious, so you better fake it. That should put you in a good position when it's time. Mosley, you and I will be with the other ritualists. As for the ritual itself, I'd say Tetelo is our worst problem. I remember from the bayou that she didn't show up until Dr. John blew that drug on Malia's face. If I can prevent him from doing that, we can keep taking Thanks for the out recap, the Gabriel. That's very helpful well, how of are you. you. Do now, that? could we move on to a scene with something besides <laughs> exposition? Uh huh. What if Tetelo does show up? I'm gonna replace that Let's powder just worry that about making in sure that with my doesn't. semen. <laughs> okay, so you're gonna prevent this spirit thing from showing up? Fine. I'll take care of the big guy, Dr. John, when the time comes. And I can handle Malia herself. As long as she is Malia. Well, keep an eye on her. I'm good, but don't hurt her. I want to bang Ooh, her later. Me? We'll wait for your signal, man. Fine, but you guys aren't going to get far looking like that. Beow, 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 beow. <laughs> Here, it's a disguise. Gee, a boar. How thoughtful. And what are you, pray tell? Can we give Mosley the wolf outfit with that wolf? Uh, a wolf? You goddamn wiener. <laughs> Don't. Whoa. Whoa. That, that was the wrong thing. What the thing. fuck was that? I guess we've been recording all of our conversations. A wolf. How appropriate. Yeah, remember how I just told Mosley that like 30 seconds ago? Someone's coming. Race, get down. You <laughs> leather trench coat. What are you doing here? Yeah. Right Dr. there. Room was empty. On the floor. Go to the circle. Now. Whoa, we're in the circle. Yep. So so here's where it might get slightly racist. Yeah. I'm, I'm sure this was like heavily researched though. I think that but like last time we at least had like some nude voodoo priestesses and stuff. They're all wearing clothes this time. Damn it. 
She's already been ridden by Tetelo. What? What? You said... See, if I were at one of these voodoo ceremonies, I would be that guy in, like, the lion outfit in the back who obviously doesn't know how to dance, but it's just like, if I just keep <laughs> repeating this kind of rhythmic movement, then maybe nobody will notice. Just, oh, just, oh god, she's coming close, she's uh, coming close, this... just keep doing the same movement. <laughs> and Gabriel and Mosley are just hanging out here watching. Nobody thinks that's weird. <laughs> In a group this small, wouldn't they, like, oh, notice that these guys are out of place? Take this sacrifice. Do so quick. Yeah, you would think... Oh, tweezers. Tweezers are gonna come in handy now. <laughs> Roll to turn undead. <laughs> what? You bastard of a bastard! Can't stop me. Watch your friend die. Okay, Grace, this is your time to shine. This is... Oh. Yeah. The talisman seems to have little effect on protecting Grace from this distance. So, what, we walk closer? I like that Malia is like way like bigger and more buff than the rest, you know? Yeah. Oh, gun. Why didn't I think of gun? That's a good idea. <laughs> I lo yeah, well I figured when Mosley said I'll take care of Dr. John and that's what he was meaning. No, the cop killed him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's what I'm saying. Like, Mosley said, I'll take care of Dr. John. And I was like, okay, he brought his gun. She's screaming, but the music is really kind of still... Tetelo, you want the talisman? Here, catch. Are we going to play Keep Away from the Loa? <laughs> Apparently. Go on. Get Grace out of here. Talisman will protect you. What about... Just go! Now we just run around in circles here. You are unarmed now, witch hunter. Approach me and me. Wiggly, wiggly, wiggly. Maya, are you down? She's too powerful. Oh, well, damn, then. Uh, All right. You gave it go. your best. Go. What did we just do? We just broke the idol. Boom, 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 I'm sure boom. this is fine. Yeah. Uh-oh. I... okay. Go away! Destroy her! Destroy me! <laughs> you are true to your father, Sir Witch Hunter! I don't know oh, what Gabriel, that means, because I don't really please. know much about my father. <laughs> but thanks, I guess. I've got you, Malia! I clicked a thing. Oh, wow! Now we're spry too, because we're the witch hunter. <laughs> I won't let you kill her. Do Gabriel, do, 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 you didn't betray me. Do, do, do. I've got you. Oh, it's no good. It has to end with me. No. Do, 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 Don't let go. Do, 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 Damn it. Don't you let go. This is supposed to be Goodbye. like the climactic Goodbye. moment of this game. No. Yeah, very Alien 3 there. Oh, well, anyway. <laughs> I think it's over now. Yes. I'm sorry about Malia. I know you cared for her. Oh, uh, well, anyway, can I can I touch your butt for You've solace? You've changed, you know. <laughs> Have I? Yeah. So, um, are you going to do it? I don't know. Are we going to do it? Be shot in Jaeger? That said, be I'm shot in Jaeger. <laughs> don't worry, though. You'll be Got back at school vowel. safe and sound. I don't have to go back. Grace, give up your Ph.D.? There are things in this world, Gabriel. A spiritual path could be more important than a path of the mind. Spiritual path, huh? Well, you're welcome to stay, Grace. 
Just as long as you don't expect me to know what I'm doing. This is a historical moment, is isn't it? Somebody gonna notice? 300 years ago, the Ritter Talisman was stolen by Tello. There's a giant Tello. lava pit She's in the middle of New Orleans now. <laughs> I don't remember reading she about that. The slave maybe, um, She's maybe this is gonna be blamed on the storm. Katrina? Did you know well, that there are two Marie Laveaus? Is that pertinent to this? <laughs> what do you What do you know about snakes? <laughs> you know, good coming from evil. You think too much. But really, I think the most tragic thing is all those generations. Does of that lion have a human lion. face? Trapped it, by this it, large it oval does, and a mustache. Looks like, it, looks it looks like William looks Henry like Howard Taft, car. kind of. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Reminds me of living with you, Grace. You know why I said you've changed? Yeah? I was wrong. Are you sorry? No. I like your insensitive sexist ways. Right? Wonder, I wonder where what we missed we the miss? two points. Damn it, we have to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I... Okay, so that's the one thing that I actually kind of liked out of that was the fact that Grace is like, you know, maybe maybe PhD isn't the most important thing in the world anymore because I just saw that fucking voodoo is real, you know? Right. Like, it always annoyed me, like, in the Marvel Universe, uh, uh, or the DC Universe, I think, does it too, whenever they do all that bullshit where, like, um, the, uh, like they'll go to heaven or, or you know meet angels or whatever and I'm like you know what I don't care what superpowers I have if I had like that sort of visceral upfront proof that there was a heaven and like, Christianity was right it's like n tomorrow I'm enrolling in the priesthood you know right <laughs> like oh shit like this is all but instead they're always like well anyway on with my life Yep, I guess I'll go back to being a hardcore skeptic. <laughs> We're still sticking with the red. I mean, at least it's not red on red. I mean, <laughs> right. Kind of. Maybe that's the two points that we missed. We didn't go back and talk to Grandma some more. I have a feeling that Grandma had more. So, what do you think? Is there going to be a post-credit scene? I don't know. It seems... Well, it's 93. It was probably slightly prior to that sort of being a standard. Yeah. It's hard to say. Mark Hamill also played the Jeep driver. Good going. He's so versatile. He just has so much range. <laughs> and so, uh, Tim Curry was also the butler, of course. Who was? Tim Curry. Uh, he, he was what butler? Molly is Butler. Oh, so he was talking to himself? Yeah, we've talked about this before. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long time we've been working on this, okay? Yeah, that's right. I remember back when we started when we were still at war in Vietnam. <laughs> I think maybe the yellow line through the middle of your red credits, not not the best idea either. <laughs> it gives them depth and makes them look 3D though, man. Um, it really makes them just difficult to shift to read. <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, oh. Music's fading. we still got ten minutes, maybe. Maybe? Ten minutes? Yeah. Oh. Why is it so dark in here? Oh, maybe these are ways Dr. to die. Kong? Hello. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, good. Do we just get to see snakes kill Gabriel over and over? <laughs> oh. All right. So yeah, we do just get to watch Gabriel die. I am all for this. You! What are you doing here? I was just taking a walk in. No excuses this time, my friend. Oh, he should have thrown us into the fire. Oh, good God, he just crumpled us into 2D. <laughs> when in Rome. He 
here goes nothing. Isn't this exactly what we did? Yeah, but I assume we're gonna like do something stupid once we're here. Oh. Welcome. Oh, Better maybe we answer nine. wrong. Please yeah. join the other celebrants. But first, oh, yeah. Yes, Doctor John. Brother Eagle. Oh, see, we knew but he was first. Brother Eagle somehow. But we didn't know that was him. He had his back to us. In his maybe we were supposed to recognize his voice. Yeah, I mean, come on. Papa, get it? You are no believer. <laughs> you must die for violating our sacred circle. Oh. Choke us again? Yeah. You, I do it. <laughs> you shall pay for this violation. But yep. I, th I think your voodoo is real cool. I, I want to join your club, please. I got this <laughs> thing tattooed on my arm. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get eaten by a zombie here. A mummy. mummy. Totally a mummy. Then a rumble. Uh-oh. I have a feeling that did something. That's what she said? Maybe. Whoa, oh. what? <laughs> Pulled our heart right out. No, did it? A Temple of Doom action there? Oh, okay. That made it a little clear. Gabriel, no! <laughs> Does he just strangle us again? Gabriel Knight, how dare you violate my sanctuary? Oh, is this your room? I'm so sorry. Oh, strangle. Just... Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you are so dead. If that's true, who are you talking to? Okay, I'll give it a shot, but I'm no musician. Maybe we summon thunder or something? <laughs> Oh, here we just wait for him and he strangles us again. There's a lot of Dr. John strangling us here, I guess. In the distance. This music is rocking. Oh, uh, we probably we take the wrong path. And then we meet him? Yeah. Whoop. Hey, Dr. John. <laughs> doop, 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 doop. <laughs> Gabriel Knight. So it was you on the drums. Uh, no. Malia invited me down. You lie. You will die for that. Today is a good day to die. <laughs> Gabriel Knight, <laughs> what are you doing here? And who is this with you? Who? Him? He's a friend of mine, see? We were just. <laughs> Hope he strangles me. will both first. die. Oh. <laughs> oh. No response from Mark Hamill there. <laughs> Someone's coming! Race! Get down! Gabriel Knight, <laughs> what are you doing here? And who is this with you? Who? Him? He's a friend of mine, see? We were just... You will both die! <laughs> At least he fired off a shot that time. Yeah. It's, there aren't many. There aren't any ways to die any earlier in the game other than that snake. All the deaths are here at the end. And then no, if we do huh. nothing, yeah, I, I wonder. Aren't there any? I, there must, maybe these were just the funniest ones. Maybe I should have done something. <laughs> He was fumbling for his gun, I think. I feel so bad for this voice actor because she was obviously, like, screeching and they just totally fucked up the sound mix here. Yeah, they turned her way down. Oh, that's a fire pit back then, not a transporter. <laughs> Who did play Molly Getty? I don't know. No! <laughs> Wait, what happened? I don't talent. know. <laughs> Whoa! Something oh. a whip. Her knife turned into a whip. <laughs> you are unarmed. 
Come now, witch hunter. Approach me and leave. Well, all right, that seems fair. Malia, are you there? She's too powerful. All right, well, good night. <laughs> Still funny. She gives us a while. Yeah. We don't do anything. Yeah. Colombian necktie. <laughs> I love that they have that little sting for like nearly every death. <laughs> so now something like this, if we don't go to save her, it seems like that should be okay, you know? Like, like I mean, right. it, it, Destroy. how does that change Destroy the end? Me. You are truly your father's I don't know, maybe it like corrupts hunter. our soul and we cross over to the dark Gabriel, side. I think please. that anytime there's lava around, that there's a high risk of getting turned to the dark side. Mm, makes sense. Take the stick and push her down. <laughs> or just sit here for a while. <laughs> uh, no, I'm good, thanks. Titolo was right. You do nothing. You betray me. I'm sorry. I have no choice. Oh, now she's gonna leap up and oh, that whip. It's not over yet, my love. If I go, you go. Well, that seems fair. <laughs> I can't believe he's gone. Yeah. I'm gonna miss a loafer. <laughs> Saved our lives, you know. You done good. <laughs> oh, so we do so get the end. We do get the ending. End, oh. That they destroyed each other. I can't help thinking that it could have been different. You can't ask. Vote for me ready. this election, William and Henry Howard Taft. But a world without Schottenegger's. <laughs> sad. Oh, well, they we screwed up the spelling the of Schottenegger on that one too. Huh? Yeah. Schottenegger's. Schottenegger. Bye, Gabriel Knight. Good, so good night, long. Gracie. <laughs> uh, I've been waiting for that one. <laughs> boo, 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 boo. Apparently, not dying is worth like twelve points. <laughs> yeah. I really don't want to be dead. Can we try that again? <laughs> <laughs> no, we're done with you forever, Gabriel. Forever. Oh. Goodbye. Goodbye. Boo, boo, boo. <laughs> the oh. end. Oh. <laughs> You know, with a game like this, though, you might expect that there's there's a possibility of like a bad ending. Like I played a game once. I don't I don't remember what the hell it was called, but it was like some sort of like mech warrior type game, right? Like you get in a big fighting suit and you're deployed on different missions and you fight on different planets. And like I got to this point that I couldn't figure out another way to get beyond it. And so I think it was the actual ending, but it's like you die and you find out that the whole time you've been fighting angels. And it's like, wait, That's weird. what? Like, how does this, <laughs> this raises more questions than it answers. And so I was always like, I don't know if I beat that game. And then by the time that like the internet was around and I could check these things, you know, now I, I have no idea what the game was called. And so, <laughs> so I can't, I can't find out. And it's like, oh, well, you know, whatever. Yeah. A lot of these old games like this one, there's some little thing that you have to have done in the first third of the game and if you don't you can't win yeah yeah and and like this like there are like if, if you don't grab that accounting book or if you don't put that stick i guess i guess you know if mostly doesn't show up because of the stick but like if you don't grab that accounting book then it's not like you ever give it to Mosley for the FBI to have. Maybe that's the two points we missed. Maybe while we're talking to Mosley in there, we can give, him, give that him that book. book. Yeah, who yeah. knows? But probably there was something much earlier on that <laughs> God only knows. Yeah. We, we didn't ask somebody important about snakes. That's probably what it was. Missed a piece of snake information. I hate yeah. when that happens. Yeah, snake-based information. So, um, so I don't know. Did we learn anything from this? Um uh, we learned something about voodoo, right? Yeah, there's two Marie Laveaux's, actually. Good um, we learned that um, video games in the 90s were, like, super sexist and racist. <laughs> I think that's probably... I, I, I'm going to guess it's true of video games even now, right? Like, like it's, it's probably one of those things that's just systematic. 
Yeah, although I think it's getting a bit less so. Like, I think that video game developers are starting to realize that, for instance, female players are actually a major market share, are in fact a majority (laughs) market share now in video games. Though, to be fair, they became one even while all the games were male dominated like by like the way that they presented them so probably we're okay to just keep doing the same thing probably yeah um you know (laughs) you know there's okay so the game resistance it was one of the launch games for ps3 right friend of mine and i friend of mine and i played that two player and we couldn't figure out if it was racist or if it was an indictment of the racism around uh, World War II, because it's like an alternate World War II where aliens come in, right? Right. And, and um, if you play two-player, the second player plays an unnamed black soldier, and then every cutscene is just exactly the same as one player, and so it's like, you know... Uh, 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 courageous Jim Davis fights on and blah 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 and nobody ever mentions the unnamed black soldier at his side the entire time (laughs) and again it's like that seems about right right it seems very (laughs) fitting for a World War II era uh, game but it's also like did they do this on purpose or was that accidental so Uh, well nice Anyway, uh, yeah, I think that's uh, I think that's good for now. Maybe maybe someday we'll be back and do the second one. But I think for now we're join just gonna... us next week for <laughs> Gabriel Knight. <laughs> What's the second one called? I can't remember. I think it's a uh, like Wolf in Sheep's Clothing or something like that. Because I'm pretty sure it's no. uh, Werewolves. Um, we should just do 2011 remake of Sins of the Fathers or whenever it was. <laughs> Yeah, so it's like exactly this, but with not as famous voice actors. I, oh man, and better and better graphics, so you can tell whether it's a telephone or a scream mask on the desk. <laughs> I guess yeah, that's helpful if you're playing it, but watching it, oh my god! All right, all of those voodoo boobies in the forest would be a lot hotter too. Probably that's true. That's true. I wonder if they scrubbed any of the racism, <laughs> or if they just like I say, if they just went wholeheartedly and took it out took out the voodoo aspect and just made it black people you know it's just this big fear of black people and their their uh, culture and their ways you know yeah i don't know anyway for now this is michael t bradley and jay wilford neville and we are